let me say this and I am not trying to offend anyone. And I pray that this makes sense. I think some people think like, I think some people place Bible teachers on a higher standard, which they should. But in a way, I think to where they can't make a mistake. If you are human, and if you are teaching about the Bible, you are human. You are going to make mistakes. What if someone was to monitor your life day in and day out? How much error would someone find? Yes, I can see if there is a Bible teacher constantly teaching the wrong stuff, constantly messing up. Okay, probably that person should not be teaching, right? Until that person can bring order in their life. But if a person messes up here and there, does it mean that person should not be teaching? I can see if a Bible teacher kills someone and, and rapes people and do all that mess there, okay, then that person probably should not teach. But if a Bible teacher get caught doing this or that and they truly repent and change from their ways, why condemn that person if that person is changed? For instance, myself, I used to be a low down, as in very mean, rude, bad man. I guess I had some good characteristics, but I guess mostly bad in a sense. Now, I don't think I do those things anymore. So, how is it just for anyone to say, Kevin, you used to do this to women, you used to do that, you stole, you lied so much, so you have no room to teach anyone about the Bible. That's the past. Listen now. I am trying to learn. I think God reveals some things, how can I say this? I don't believe everyone is on the same level. I may know some things you may not know. Someone else may know some things others may not know. Right? So if we come together as one or if we share and share our experiences and teach and whatever else, I think, like, if I am using this word right, I believe all of us can be edified. But if you looking, but if you are looking at a person's past sins and say, hey, that person is doing that, that person is doing this, I believe there are so many people like that. So if you find fault in every teacher, does that mean you are going to stop listening to teachers? Look now, if you aren't perfect, if you are crossing the line as in constantly doing what is wrong, Shouldn't you be more understanding of other people? Man, if there was a person 
that bombed or murdered one million people and if that person changed and started to teach really well about the Bible I would listen to that person I would not look at that person's past and be like man how can that person teach anyone when they done so much wrong we have to be understanding yes misunderstandings may happen we may misunderstand someone and whatever else but stop thinking that men and women of God are 100% perfect yes we are commanded to be perfect we are commanded to be perfect but how many humans do you know Christian humans do you know are perfect we have to strive for perfection so if I am growing in Jesus Christ I am not perfect but I can strive for perfection trying to correct my wrongs everyone I think if you look at anyone hard enough I believe you will find error somewhere for instance um, there is a teacher I like listening to on YouTube I agree with probably 99% of what that person says but every so often I may not agree with what that person says so just because of that 1% or whatever should I stop listening to that person there is another YouTube channel I like listening to sometimes some things sound wrong to me but the majority of what that person say seems like right on the ball on another YouTube channel so I believe we all are going to have some type of error so don't like throw everything out because you found error or small error yes if a person constantly teaching error and going toward the wrong direction okay stop listening to that person perhaps but if there is a tiny bit and that person is not purposely trying to teach error hey be understanding stop thinking men and women of God are perfect you know there are some people I believe that sin selfish and all this stuff here and I guess it is their hobby or something they like to do to point out error in other people like I hope this makes sense to you I am not perfect if you were to watch me day in day out you may say this about me you may say that about me but is that a good enough excuse to not take correction from a person yes we need to judge ourselves so let me stop here God bless you